hello guys and welcome back again to my youtube channel it's your girl ify and i am back again with another video if this is your first time here you are highly welcome please click on the subscribe button and turn on your bell notification so you get notified each time i upload a new video and to my old subscribers thank you so much for coming two months ago i made a video that was in november yeah I made a video telling you guys that we left Italy. The thing is, in that video, I did not tell you guys why and the reason we left Italy. Like, I've not told you guys the reason why we left Italy. In this video, I am going to tell you guys the truth. I'm going to tell you guys everything. And um, I'm going to be open, okay? I'm just going to tell you guys why we left Italy to so Germany. We live in Germany now. You gotta get up. Gotta get up and make a move. So guys, our plans of leaving Italy to Germany did not start today. Like it did not start this year. Did I say this year? Okay. It did not start that last year that we left. Okay. It started way before that last year. It started even before I came to Europe. Even before I joined my husband from Nigeria. My husband has wanted to leave Italy before then. But because I wanted to join him, because um, I wanted, he wanted me to come. And he had already started preparing my document to join him in Europe here. So we decided that um, we will have to wait until I get to Italy before we can come here. So that was what we did. So fast forward to when my paper and my documents were ready, my husband started making plans to come to Germany. So after I joined him, he left for Germany and uh, when he got to Germany, he got a job. Yeah, he got a job and he started working. And then I was in um, Italy with Jason then. Jason was, I think Jason was four days old when he left. He had to come here to work because um, he had to work for him to get a house. Okay, for him to get a house for his family, he had to work. So he came here immediately and started working. The next month, he started um, looking for house. So, and if you are based in Germany here, you will know that looking for house is not, like, it's not easy. Looking for house here is not easy at all, okay? It's not a walk in the park, like, it is not easy. Ask people that live in Germany and you will know. So he started looking for house. And uh, while he was looking for house, I was already in, I was still in Italy with Jason. So, and you know, for a family that is coming from another country to a different country, and we are not coming to be um, uh, asylum seekers. Let's assume we came here to seek asylum. The government will take care of us. They will foot our bills. They will feed us and take care of us, give us even house. That's if our asylum is granted. But in this case, we are not coming to seek asylum. We are coming here to live as normal citizens we are coming here to live as normal people we are not coming to be a burden to the government we are coming to live like normal people so it really took a while before my husband could get a house one of the reasons why we left italy is because of job okay you know if you are living in europe italy to be precise if you are in italy you will know that there is no job in italy especially for foreigners like the job he was doing back then in italy the pay is not enough to take care of a family. And me joining him from Nigeria means that he's going to have more bills to pay, okay? And uh, we are going to start a family. So he had more bills to pay. And maybe after paying bills at the end of the month, he may not be able to even have um, savings. So that was why he started looking for a job in Germany. And by the grace of God, he did not take time and he got a job because... Of course, we all know that Germany, there is a lot of job in Germany. You can work like, job is everywhere, okay? So, it did not take time and he got the job. Immediately he got the job, he had to leave Italy. Then my son was um, four days old. Another reason we left Italy is because in Italy, the future of your children is not guaranteed. When I say future, I do not mean that they will starve to death or something like that. But you know, this life is not is not all about food, okay? There are more to life than food. So if you are in Italy, it doesn't mean that you you will go hungry or something like that. You will not go hungry, okay? But I don't know. 
there is something called a better future better future correct future that kind of future is not in italy especially for foreigners it's not in italy for foreigners so that's why most of the children they are, that are born in italy even after school even if you graduate after school you will not even get as a foreigner you will not even get a suitable job that can pay you well in italy so and that's not the case for germany here in germany once you go to school, there is mouth watering job everywhere waiting for you, whether you are a foreigner or you are a citizen. In Italy, the job is not enough. The job there is not enough. It's not even enough for their own citizens. How much more foreigners? And which parents will not want a country where your kids will get a very good job, like a mouth watering job after schooling? In Italy, even after schooling, even the Italian citizens, their kids are leaving the country to Germany here or another European country to get a better job. How much more are we from Africa? So we really we wanted a country where after school, after our children went to school, after they have gone to school, they'll be able to get a better job. They'll be able to get a better future because better job is equal to better future. I hope you guys understand. And because you cannot compare the economy of Germany and that of Italy. Germany is way high up there compared to Italy. Okay, so um, we talked about it and we said that, okay, we are going to start a family. And if we start a family, how are we going to raise our children? How are we going to raise our kids in this country that does not have future for kids, especially foreign kids? So we needed. We started looking for um, a way to leave Germany, uh, to leave Italy. We started looking for a way to leave Italy so that we can secure the future of our children. So another reason why we left Italy is because of the language barrier. In Italy, my husband can speak Italian language very well. Like he they chop her like biscuits. He can speak it very well. <laughs> Me, I never learned now, so I'm not even going to. Italian school. I was not even planning to go to the school because I knew that once I come to Europe, we are not going to live there. So I was not, um, so I did not even try to go to school. And besides, when I came in, immediately I came into the country, I got pregnant. So I could not even go to the language school. But my husband can speak it very well, okay? But you know that Italy, their Italian language is not spoken anywhere else in the world. It's just in Italy. And in Italy, you can only um, converse with the language. Like if you're talking to Italian citizens, most of them don't even speak English. Like they don't speak English. If you're talking to them, they'll just they look you like, what is this one saying? So they don't speak English. So you have to learn that language. You have to stay there and, and integrate, learn the language and integrate there. And when you are only restricted to one type of language, you know that it cannot take you very far, okay? Especially when the language is not spoken worldwide. It's spoken in just one country. So if you go to another country, there is a possibility that you may, you will have to study another language for you to be able to um, integrate. So we never wanted that to our children. But in Germany here, they speak English. They may not be... Um, they may not be very fluent with English language. They speak their normal, their Dutch, okay? They speak their Dutch. But they speak English. Like, you cannot compare the Germans and the Italians when it comes to um, English. The Germans speak English. Their English may not be fluent. It may not be the way you want it to sound. But they understand English. They understand English better than the Italians. And this is one of the reasons we left um Italy because we knew that if our kids are here in Germany, they will be able to hear English, they will be able to hear German. We have so many other reasons, but these are the top three reasons. The top, I'm not saying that is the uh, this is all the reasons, but this is the top three reasons. For the sake of this video, I don't I will not mention all the reasons, but this is the um, top three reasons why we left Italy. So thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel, turn on your bell notification, and also share my videos. Share this video so that people that are living in Italy that wants to move 
or people that want to find more information about Italy or Germany, share it so that it will get to them. Okay. So thank you guys so much and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.